So let's see how this then plays out a little further. The binding proteins in the body, thyroglobulin, actually binds to 99% of all thyroid hormones. So the free T4 and free T3, I feel, are the best things to check because most of the thyroid is actually bound. So when we look at this, it helps us then identify what things should be in a thyroid panel. I'll share with you my personal thyroid panel. What I typically check is a TSH, a total T4, a free T4, a total T3, a free T3, a reverse T3, and then I want to look at some nutrients that are involved in the production and metabolism of thyroid hormone, which includes iodine, selenium, zinc, ferritin. And so those are the things that I typically look at. Other things that you may want to look at is magnesium and a CBC and vitamin D. When I look at some of these minerals, I like to look at them in the red blood cell form because that tells me a little bit more about what's going on in the cellular level versus what's just floating around in the plasma. The body works really hard to make sure that the plasma levels are within a tight range. So that may or may not be reflective of what's going on inside the cell. So let's talk a little bit about these labs and some of the controversy about them. TSH has been, as I already told you, the best way, according to conventional medicine, of checking on and measuring thyroid function. However, as you just heard me say too, very little about thyroid stimulating hormone function. In fact, its only function is to turn on the thyroid gland. That means that if you want to know what's going on at the cellular level, TSH is not the best tool. In fact, they found that in most patients who have thyroid symptoms, looking at a normal TSH, which range is pretty big, is not going to be enough for a screening tool. You want to start measuring TSH so that it's down in the 2, 2.5 range, and that's where it should be. Anything above that could start to signify that there's thyroid dysfunction, and the negative feedback to the brain is that it wants more thyroid hormone. 